A few weeks ago, residents protested against a lack of service delivery. One of the major issues is an under-resourced fire station. With the crossover from Eden Municipality to George Municipality, they took away all our facilities. Now we only have three firefighters on standby and they can't get to the fires on time. We're losing lives because the fire services don't have enough staff in Union Day. Two farmers allegedly shot at the protesters, wounding three people. They were arrested a couple of days later on charges of attempted murder. The charges have been changed to discharging their firearms in a municipal area. The community actually says that there is racism in regard to how, not all the police, but how some police are conducting themselves. So it's, it's critical that in this 2019, 25, 26 years after democracy, there can never be any place for racism and selective policing. Everyone needs to be given the respect and those that um, contravene the law must be arrested and dealt with. Doug Moore says he will request the National Minister of Police or his deputy, the Western Cape Minister of Human Settlements and the George Mayor to meet the community in the next 10 days. 49-year-old Martinez Luke is expected to appear in court again on the 26th of next month, while the other accused, 48-year-old Niklas Gerber, will appear on the 30th of September. Tanya Krauser, SABC News, Uniondale.